Aw, oh, yeah. Twerk that gym. Fucking love it. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's unkeepable. Never keep a one-lander. Uh, I will absolutely keep this, even though it's got a few too many lands. Ah, well, one too many lands, really. But I've got Super Domain, which makes me happy. And, I mean, pretty much everything in my hand, in my hand is playable. God, don't be Mono White. Mono White is so fucking boring. Do I dig here? No, no, I don't dig. I fucking fucking swing hard and fast. See, I put this in the graveyard real quick, right? And then he forgets all about it in a few turns. Unless he's a good player, but he's playing white, so he's not a good player. <laughs> nah, I'm fucking with you. That white doesn't mean anything. I don't even know what he's doing yet. Odds are that he's not going to play optimally, but that's just the nature of duels 2015. In fact, that's just the nature of all the duels. Even duels origins is probably going to be uh, be that. I mean, it's a casual game for God's sakes, you know. It's not. This isn't for like the fucking most hardcore people. That's what MTGO is for. Magic the Gathering Online. Uh, definitely looking like a uh, mono white so far. I'm not gonna put him on it just yet because I don't really know what he's playing. But uh, I did my six. Not really sure what to, what to expect. I'm kind of hoping he's got something else. No, he's definitely mono white now. Never mind. I take that back. Two. Wow. I never see this played. He must have just top decked this. I don't know what kind of a deck he had really weird. Oh, do you think he was doing that? Well, I don't have blue. It's not like I'm... That's weird. Okay, so now I'm looking for a blasting station. Uh, since I'm looking for a blasting station, I'm probably just going to Elvish Visionary over uh, uh, Thrinax. I do like Thrinax more, obviously. Hmm. Okay. That's also alright. So now I know what he's playing, at least. He's playing this uh, totally, totally awesome mono white uh, all eggs in one basket deck. So he gets to hope to hell that I, I don't have removal, which I don't, but little does he know. <coughs> if I have one more land and a blasting station, I could do that whole combo in one in one turn where I take it and pop it into his shitter. I talk about butts a lot in this channel, don't I? I'm sorry, you guys. That's that's kind of weird. I ain't even gay. Uh, still need the blasting station, unfortunately. I will absolutely swing here. I mean, he's only hitting me for three. It's not, like, the worst thing in the world. I can probably still race him. I don't think I want to grab that just yet. I, I'm actually going to wait until he does something a little more crazy. I mean, Armed Ascension is going to suck. And you know he runs it. There's no question about that in my head. Uh, it doesn't look like he has it just yet. Oh, okay. That's actually pretty good. Hmm. So what do I want? I, I mean... I'm actually thinking, like, if I get the Blasting Station soon... Nah, I'm... Oh, man, I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Yeah, I still want to get rid of that 3-3. It's just too it's just doing too much to me. Uh definitely dropping this right now. Got another one in the pocket. Now the option is to grab something, which I don't really want to do. So never mind. There are no options. I'm just dropping my young wolf and pass and turn. I mean I've got two decent cards in my pocket right now. And he's still got four. And he's doing pretty well. He's not doing badly, so he can absolutely win this. Wow, he's got a lot of uh, uh this is he's got a lot of flyers. I mean that is kind of the nature of mono white. Hmm. I need I need some more win conditions here. I need uh raid bombardment or or uh blasting station. Prefer blasting station strongly, so I'm absolutely going to pre-combat play a Visionary, hoping I'm going to grab one of those bastards. That's not quite what I'm looking for. It gains lifelink until end of turn. Should I grab it and just swing with it? Or should I swing with No, I'm not going to swing with that. No, fuck it. I'll just grab this. <coughs> 
I really wish I had a blasting station. But uh, that's just kind of the nature of it all, man. Oh well. Doesn't look too good for me, honestly, right now. It looks uh, quite bad. Quite bad indeed. He had some. He had some good uh, early game plays. Oh, not early game. Like you know, turn two and three plays. Okay. Hmm. That really sucks. At least he doesn't get double life length. There's no such thing for that. But uh, it also means that if I grab one of these, he could chump it. Assuming I attack with just one. Yeah, of course you do this. Well, I mean, this isn't a particularly. Um... All right, look, he's torqued that gym. You got a great name. You got a shit avatar. I don't really like this deck, but it's not a shit deck. It's not a shit deck at all. I thought I thought this was something a little bit different, and I am just not picking what I need to pick at all. Um, I mean, I, I just have to swing here. Like, I can't just keep holding back. In fact, I think I'm just dead next turn. Is there any... Yeah, there's no point to this, actually. What the hell's the... Yeah. I'm done. Nothing I can do. Alright, uh, since this is already over, I'm just gonna send him the good game. He wins it, and I lost. So, that's it. Next game. Let's give it a shot here. Let's hope we don't run into something like that again. Um, again, we're really hoping for, like interesting decks. They don't have to be good decks. They, in fact, they shouldn't be good decks. Let's hope they're shitty decks. Let's hope they're as shitty as my deck. But, um... Let, let's just not hope. Like, Selesnia. You know, Selesnia tokens, that's, that's kind of interesting. It's it's There's pretty much only, like, one or two ways to make that deck, but uh, it's, it's better than Mono White. It honestly is better than Mono White. And Life Gain, ugh, God. So tasteless, you know. That's like wearing a fucking clown suit to a graduation party, you know? You're just showing up like, hey guys! It's like, yeah, you got the attention, congratulations, but you didn't get any respect. Custom match. Mmm, fuck that. I'll make my own match. It's gonna have blackjack and hookers in it. Is that the second time I referenced blackjack in this episode? Crazy! Nah, that's not crazy at all. I, I don't, th have I ever played blackjack? I think I have. Once? No, no. And by play, I mean, I'm not not like with friends or anything, but like uh, legit casino, money on the line, blackjack shit. You know, the good stuff. There we go. Alrighty. Alrighty indeed. <coughs> I got my win condition in my fucking pocket. I got shit that can die, I got a grabby hand, I got a nice combo, Every, everything here is good. Everything here is looking really fine. What, what, why did I, why did I put that over the, holy shit, I'm dumb. How dumb am I? I have to put this down now, I have no, oh god. Oh god, <laughs> what a terrible, wow, this is, this is what I get for not thinking, man. Ooh, are you John too? Uh, okay. I'm going to go with no prop. Well, maybe. He might be. He might still be. I don't know. I mean, he's going to hit me for at least two. Do I want to put power on the field, or do I want... Or do I want my shit to happen? I'm going to put this right down now. I'm going to put this down now. This gives me a little more everything. Like, I can't block him. But... I can still kill him next turn if he doesn't pump it. That can be a really good card. Like, in green, these kinds of cards are really powerful. You can really pump the hell out of these things and pretty much negate all the other the enemy's creatures. Like, in drafting, that's what I mean. That's what I'm trying to get to. Uh, drafting that, that is really pretty awesome. Because uh, you, you, you draft a bunch of these fuckers, and then you get some uh, a bunch of pump spells and shit, and you pretty much just have unblockable creatures that just come in for a fucking hand, like a hammer. Just a, a giant hammer, and your testicles are just sitting there on the side of the curb, and they got little target signs on them, and you, you just you can't move. You just sort of sit there and watch it just hammer on your scrooch 
Oh, wow, land destruction. Crazy. Okay. I mean, that doesn't really fuck me, actually. I'm, I'm okay with that. That thing's gone now. And I get two counters on my, uh, on my finger doodle. Which makes me happy. Alright. I mean, I, is this a land destruction deck? You know what? There have been, uh, not another one. See, that's, that's the problem with fucking Blasting Station. You don't want to see two of them. Um, there have been a lot of, um, people out there. Uh, legend, I think, and and uh, Mobius both did land destruction decks recently, and I think uh, I think that might be this some kind of a take on it. Maybe I mean I'm only gauging that on based on this one card, really. What the fuck is this? Is this a double strike? No, this is just a three three. Okay. Well, I'm taking it. <laughs> it's, that's that's my 3-3. Three, three. Where did you get that, man? I think this is one of my cards. It got shuffled into your deck. Dude, how did you get this? How did you get this? That's, that's, fucked, that's fucking weird. Shock! Oh, you're a good player. You're a good player. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. All right. Gonna have to let it through, because I need to kill that guy. I'm still taking you, buddy. See? That's my card. That's what I was talking about. That is still my fucking card. Damn. Did not expect that shot coming. I mean, uh, he's, he's red, obviously. I should have, but I didn't. Makes me feel pat pretty bad. Pretty bad. Okay. Um, do I drop this? Yes, I do. And I'll bring out my 5-5 five, five next turn. And, uh... It looks like he's not gonna do a whole lot. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck he's playing, man. I, I, I have no idea. Fucking Undying Wolf. Like, really? You know how expensive that piece of shit wolf is? Oh, mate, you know what he's doing? He's just playing all the crazy cards. Oh, no, 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 no. This is a beast deck. Who am I kidding? Oh, yeah, that's what he's got going on here. This is a beast deck. For sure. Oh, well, no. It's a wolf deck. Huh. That's cool. I mean, he tried to go tribal with it. I don't mind that at all. Alright. I mean, hey, you know, that's it, fucking awesome. And I'm going to stop that right now. Oh, wait, no, I can't. I can't because it says undying. It'll just come right back. Shit. Um... No. Okay, well, actually, yeah, that's fine. You'll still lose it. I mean, it comes back as a uh, 5-3, I think. Hmm. No, I'm not going to do anything about that. I can hit him for 2 in the face right now. Raised by wolves. This is what This is the whole point of his deck, isn't it? This fucking card right here. <laughs> I mean, it's cute. I, I like it. I like that he's got some crazy shit happening here. He's taking me to 10. I think he's still dead. Yeah, he is dead. Oh, no, he's definitely dead now. Okay. Well, that was fun. I mean, super cool. Uh, super, super cool deck. I will give him a good game. Because I like I like weird decks, and I wanted a weird deck, and he gave me a weird deck, man. I fucking love it. Good shot, man. I hope I, I, hope I showed him a weird deck, too. I hope he liked it. And it looks like he didn't. He didn't. He didn't reciprocate my good game. Okay, I think I have time for one more, right? Maybe? One more? Let's give it one more shot. I'm having fun. Let's go, baby cakes. Come on. Come on, why is it taking so long? This shouldn't take this long. Alright, here we go. 
Elvis? Are you fucking kidding me? 1876 Elvis. That's fucking awesome. I have always... That's not true. You know what? It, I'm, I'm, I'm lying. I'm saying I always wanted to play Elvis, but that's not... <clears throat> that's not really true, because I've always had this idea that Elvis was, like, just this model that old women really enjoyed and no one else really understood. Like, this was a generational thing that was just beyond me. It wasn't really... It just wasn't my life. It was some other woman's life. And I always pictured, like, this little... This little lady in, like, her 60s or something with all these Elvis... Elvis face commemoratives China wear and uh, Elvis phones and Elvis seat covers and she just like got all rolled up into it and she just fucking loves the guy for like no reason that's what I always had in mind um alright this is excellent I can I can drop this guy and Hellspark Elemental I'm gonna get one tick or one uh, counter due to Hellspark Elemental <laughs> And I'll be able to hit him for five this turn, even though he, uh, even though he tried to negate all that damage with one of those uh, really, really, really good decks or cards. Excuse me, the Radiant Fountain cards are so good. I'm actually not even looking at his colors. I should be. Oh, interesting colors. I wonder if he's using this to throw me off. These don't usually go together very well. Oh, maybe he's doing a five color. What the fuck is he playing? Do you think this is just an is it deck and he just threw in a bunch of crazy shit? Hmm. I'm starting to feel starting to feel funny about this. Alright, well this is definitely coming out. Enjoy your four damage to the face. Uh he's probably not blocking that. <laughs> That'd be funny. Um not gonna hold I I mean here I am, like, I never do math, but in this situation, you wouldn't hold back a 1-1, one, one because, uh, <coughs> this 1-1 one, one with Rape Bombardment does 2 damage, and this guy here does 2 damage, so I wouldn't hold that back, and so he can swing with me for 2, and this one guy I'll swing for him for 2, and it'll be a fair change, and I'm winning the race anyway, so that's why I'm not holding it back. Um, he's acting as though he will block with that, which is really strange. <coughs> uh, Visionary can't actually grab me anything that I would want at this point. Uh, Sprouting Thrinex isn't going to do anything immediately, although it could. Hmm. Damn, I wish I had another red. No, I think, I think my play here... Oh, boy. Oh boy. No, you know what? Fuck it. I'm I'm actually oh man. I guess I'll I'll play the Thrinex this turn. I really wasn't thinking about it. I was thinking of dropping Hellspark Elemental back on the field. But um I don't know, for some reason Thrinex is coming back to me. Telling me uh I sh I should drop this guy instead. He doesn't really sync with Rape of Armament right now and I have and I don't see any way for him to do that, but I have a feeling with this two combination that he's going to be able to drop a few uh, a few more things. And he's going to want to start swinging and doing damage to me soon. So uh, having Thrinex out, I would be happy to block anything, even if it has Death Touch. I mean, I want Thrinex to die, frankly, especially with Rape of Barman out. It'll get me a fucking 5-5. Five five. It'll get me three creatures, which will swing for six. I mean, in every way it's better. Yeah, Talorant. Okay, this is definitely an Izzet deck. He just threw in some wonky stuff. I see. I see what's going on here. No, wait, that's not, is it? What the fuck is this for? This guy's trying to really fuck me over, man. <laughs> I don't know what the hell's going on here. Um, I will drop this, too. And now I'm... No, you know what? I can empty my hand, so that's what I'm going to do. Again, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to push back the Hellspark Elemental in favor of dumping my hand. Now normally you don't really want to dump your hand, but I'm getting pretty close to throwing out a 5-5. Five five. That's right. Give me those counters, baby. Give me those counters. And he, and he's... Shit, he's up against the wall right now. 
I'm going to have a visionary, which is going to give me a, a magic card, and he's not going to know what it is. As far as he knows, it's going to be this goblin arsonist. Unfortunately, the card is much less useful than goblin arsonist, but I don't have any need for it on the field yet. I don't have anything... Nope. <coughs> uh, he's in a lot of trouble. He's taken um, minimum two damage next turn as things stand. Uh, I've pretty much played out. Hellspark is absolutely coming out. Here come now. See now he's just stabilized. But look, look at the life total differences here. He's just getting he's just getting the rollout happening. Uh, switcheroo, huh? All right. I can live with this. <laughs> is he going to be swinging though? Hmm, whoops. My uh, alarm just went off. It's 4.30. Oh, uh, wait, wait. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. God damn it. God fucking damn it. <laughs> that sucks. Alright, whatever. Um, I'm still swinging with everything. That's coming in for at least three damage. Uh, he's probably going to hit me for 4, because I don't have anything to stop the air. I really should have a 5-5 five, five on the field swinging in 2, but it's just going to get chumped anyway by that 1-1. One, one. So I guess at the end of the day it doesn't really matter. Interesting move to switch it with a 1-1. One, one. Well, I guess he couldn't, didn't really have any choice, huh? Because because the 1-1 one, one sinks with the raid bombardment. I wonder if he knew that and he didn't care and he just wanted that 3-3. Three, three. Because he could have just indefinitely chumped that 3-3 three, three instead and just not have to worry about the Raid Bombardment going straight to his face. Because if he just keeps pumping out tokens, he'll be okay. <coughs> uh, interesting choice. He just lost. But hey, <laughs> whatever, man. Um, sure, fine. Wow, we got to sit through all these triggers. All right, well, um, good timing with all this. Uh, I had fun. I like his deck. I'm going to give him the good game because he, he was he was a good player. I liked him. I like his deck. Uh, he took a little a little too long to uh, stabilize, unfortunately. Oh, damn. I wonder what he said. I think he just said good game, maybe. All right. Um, good timing. My timer just went off. i gotta I got to do a few chores. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.